A wolf spotting has a community in Bonner County on edge because it was an unusual spotting, the color, and it wasn't afraid of humans. That's why neighbors say it probably came from this compound and accused the wolf people of not doing enough. Wolf didn't even bat an eye. He just kept walking down the road, just kind of turned around and looked at him and just wasn't bothered by it at all. With two little kids, a husband out of town, and a wolf nearby, Chelsea Earls has only one option. I can't go outside without having a firearm with me. Uh, you know, a fear of if this wolf does show up, not knowing what it, how it's going to react. Earls is sure this wolf belongs to her neighbors over the hill, the wolf people. These have been raised in captivity. They have no wild tendencies. Right. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it's a wild animal. There's yeah. still, there's a limit. You can't save. Yeah forever, you know. Mike Marzio is a wolf handler for the 21-year-old Wolf People compound. They keep the animals for educational purposes. In June, Creco, a white Arctic wolf, dug himself out of a cage. On June 26th, Chelsea's husband took a picture of this white wolf. We can't tell if it is our wolf or not without seeing, you know, the front, the face. Marzio admits he didn't notify Fish and Game right away because they didn't want the community to be alarmed. Chelsea believes wolf people lied because they didn't want to get in trouble. We do understand that uh, people do have a concern and with this particular animal, if it is uh, uh, our wolf, it is not a, um, a threat to anybody. He's uh, extremely nice. Marzio says the wolf is 14 and has kidney failure. They thought he'd be dead by now. But Chelsea says neighbors saw the wolf a week and a half ago and wants the fear gone from her life. The wolf being captured by the wolf people or somebody in our area shooting it, unfortunately. The escape of the wolf and fallout has some neighbors calling for change in legislation, either a complete ban on keeping predatory animals or more rules on how you keep them. At the Wolf Compound in Bonner County, Colleen O'Brien, KXOY4 HD News.